Hey guys, it's uh, Rich here. Thanks for uh, clicking on this video and welcome to my man cave down here in my home. This is called the Boggs Tavern, the best bar for bourbon bogs and baseball. And as you can tell by the name of the tavern and what, what you see in front of you, I'm a big Wade Boggs fan and a uh, big Wade Boggs super collector. Uh, for those of you who are subscribed to my channel, uh, you probably know I don't do too many videos, and uh, but this may be the start of something new for me. However, uh, the impetus for this uh, particular video is uh, insp uh, inspiration from a good buddy of mine uh, by the name of John, John Riker, uh, whose uh, YouTube channel currently, uh, is the name of it escapes me, uh, I believe it's Wade Boggs fan actually, yeah, Wade Boggs fan. John and I are good buddies, um, and we are also co-administrators of a Facebook Wade Boggs fan page uh, named Wade Boggs Super Collectors page, and we also co-admin a Twitter account together, although, uh, honestly, John does more of the daily in ins and outs of the running of the, the Twitter page. I, I don't do much, um, but my name is ascribed to the channel, <laughs> or to the page, excuse me. It's um, at Twitter. Boggs or sorry, at Boggs fan on Twitter. So uh, feel free to uh, like our Facebook page or uh, follow us on Twitter. Uh, John also has a Twitter page. It's at Wade Boggs fan, and I am at Boggs328 on Twitter as well. So please give us a follow. Uh, also, I guess I got to do the uh, the appropriate YouTube uh, mantra and have you guys like this video, click subscribe. Hit the bell so that you uh, can get um, alerts for any other videos that I might upload. And like I said, I don't do too many videos, but this may be the start of something new for me. So uh, back to the reason for this video. Uh, my buddy John recently posted a video uh, with regards to a Wade Boggs uh, Holy Grail item that he's been looking for. And I guess I didn't really know that I needed to look out for it because I didn't know it existed until I watched John's video. So as a super collector of Wade Boggs, I am uh, slightly embarrassed to say that I didn't know the, these uh, two versions of this Wade Boggs set actually exist. So what am I talking about? Well, it's with regards to the uh, this 1988 Star Nova 9 card set of Wade Boggs. Uh, Star also made sets of other players, eh, Ricky Henderson, Andre Dawson, Don Mattingly, uh, Ryan Sandberg, just to name a few. What I didn't know until just recently is that this set in particular, um, I did know that other sets are made in a gloss and a matte version, but I didn't know that this set here came in a gloss version and a matte version. Uh, I own many star sets of... Oh, my, my daughter's calling me. Hey, Karis, I'm doing a video right now, so I can't talk, okay? <laughs> so just give me a second, all right? <laughs> That's what you get from going live here. So this set here comes in a gloss version and a matte version. And from watching John's video, it appears that the gloss version is the more common, uh, commonly found set, as opposed to the matte version. So I don't know what I have in this bag. I did already pre-cut the top of the bag, so I didn't, I didn't have to do that while uh, on this video. So I have not looked in yet. I don't know if this is the gloss or the matte. I have a feeling it's probably gloss, just because looking through this dusky plastic bag, it looks glossy. But I'm hoping that it's matte. So I guess we'll, uh, we'll pull it out, and we'll see what we got here. So drum roll. Actually, let me just take a quick sip of this. Varsity bourbon here. Ah, goes down some All right, well, let's see what we got here. So, that ah, feels glossy, so I think this is the gloss. Here we go, one, two, three. Yep, it's the gloss. So, so I guess John and I will now be on the hunt for the matte version. So, John, may the best collector win. <laughs> no, actually, I do hope you get it before me. I, I would be, I wouldn't be mad at all. 
but these are really cool cards. I love these star sets. They got great photography, great action shots, great candid shots. So there's Wade right there, minor league stats, as my daughter Karis pulls up a spot next to me. <laughs> hey, baby, how you doing? Hi. And major league stats. Hold on. Hold on, babe. Hold on, babe. I'm doing a video. Hold on. <laughs> Wade Box All-Star stats. Postseason stats. 200 plus hit streak. Of course, we everybody knows if you're a Box fan that Wade owns the major league record, a record that I believe will never be broken. So you can put this up right up there with you know, Cy Young, Joe DiMaggio, and uh, I'll even say Hank Aaron's home run record because I don't buy into uh, Barry Bonds. He's not the home run king. Hammer and Hank is, in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. But Wade owns the Major League record of four straight seasons of 200 hits plus 100 walks. It's never been done. Lou Gehrig owns the Major League record for most number of cumulative seasons of 200 hits plus 100 walks. I believe that number is seven. I could be wrong. But Wade is the only player to do it four straight seasons. And that's just unreal. Uh, I really do believe that's a record that uh, will never be broken. And the 300-plus average streak, of course. More records. I love this picture. I'm not sure what Wade's doing. Looks like he's just playing around in the outfield. Maybe he was uh, in shallow left field doing a uh, uh, spectacular long throw to first base to get somebody out. But whatever he's doing, no doubt he made it look spectacular. <laughs> batting champ. We all know he won five batting championships. 83. 85, 86, 87, 88. And personal data. Uh, wife, Debbie. Daughter, Megan. Son, Brett. And he lives in Tampa. And he was born June 15th, 1958 in Omaha, Nebraska. I didn't have to look at the fact. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. And uh, John. All right, brother. Both of us are on the lookout for a, uh, a matte version of this set. Thanks for watching the show, or I should say watching the video, and my daughters are screaming goodbye, so everybody, peace out.